So I welcome you all to my mathematics class for uh, A standard. So in the last class, number system, uh, number related to number system, we have learnt. Uh, yeah, under that, uh, playing with the numbers they have given. Because uh, through play, play play method, uh, children should learn. So you must think and do this one. This is like a game and puzzles you keep on doing. Here also, you think and do some of the sum, very simple way they have given. So the same thing here also, finding out, uh, uh, finding out the number in between the numbers, so after the numbers, so previous numbers, so and the pattern they have given the different numbers. So following that pattern, you have to find out uh, further numbers. So like that, uh, so we have to enjoy when we have work out the sums. So that is what the title itself indicates uh, playing with the numbers. Under this sum of the puzzle, so in the beginning of the lesson, uh, so uh, if you give very complicated concepts, so you feel very bad. So mathematics is very difficult or boring. Uh, so you may think of in such a way. So because of that, uh, they have given uh, very simple sums uh, like uh, first standard, second standard, third standard. You have uh, learned uh, integers, you have uh, natural numbers, whole numbers, and greater number, and lesser number, even number, odd number, and rational number, irrational number, real numbers, everything you have studied in 7th uh, standard. So based on that, uh, surprising things uh, they have given in your textbooks. And also test of visibility also you have studied uh, in 7th standard. Very easy if you know table very well. Uh, so test of divisibility is easy. And also you, you must know place value, unit place, tens place, hundred place, thousand place. Uh, like this if you know all the way, so mathematics will be very easy. You don't feel difficult. Uh, but if you don't know these basic things, uh, mathematics is a bit difficult. Uh, that's why children don't neglect them. In future, in this generation, mathematics is very important. You have to increase your intelligence in this area. Competitively, you can lead your life, you can earn more. So that is the thing. So in the school level itself, we are giving number of sums and making you to do it. So in future, no need anybody's help. The basic ideas, if you have means, you can handle anything. So now let us uh, go for second class. This is my second class. First class I taught you. So related to this uh, playing with the numbers itself. So now we will pass on to further, uh, further ending. So in your textbook, uh, some games and puzzles. So some games and puzzles involving digits and divisibility. So here some games and games. Games and puzzles. So this ending. Given in your textbook. If you buy the textbook, you can do the sums. Here, the first one, just see, suppose you take, for example, asking your friend, hey, take any memorable number, you memorize any number, you tell me, I will do it something, you can ask. He may take the number, suppose he may take the number, so 49, 49, he said, your friend said, 49, number are so, okay, so this is, uh, make it as reverse this one. This one, this is a puzzle, nothing else. Reverse. So, reverse you do it. Reverse of this number is uh, 94. 94, then it down, 94. So, now add root, add root. What is that term? 49 plus 94, 94. What is that? What do you get an initial term? So 30 in 10 to 14, 143 you are getting. 143 you are getting. So which number is divisible by 143? 143 is divisible by which number? That is 11. Divide by 11 is equal to 143 by 11 is equal to 11 ones are 11. That is 30. So this is the way you can solve the problems, number of problems with your friends. Take another number, any other number you take. Example, 27. 27 you take. 
four, one, seven, four, one, one, seven, four, one, seven, four. Add it. Add it. Eight, twelve. One, so six, twelve, thirteen. One, five, ten, twelve, thirteen. Once again, this is divided by thirty-seven. You are getting a result. The same thing. What is that? Thirty-six. You are getting. The family numbers you are supposed to do it. Operation if you go. Operation if you go. A, B, C. Interpretation for the operation for the letter C is go for A. Continuation B. Continuation C. Continuation once again A. A B C already go over C A B C A B. So once again B C A. This is the interpretation we are using. Under triple number, three number, two number A B and B. So A B C three numbers like this cycle. If you go means you can solve the problem. But not very simple. So go through textbook to see what comes they have given you. Try to learn best to understand. And one more puzzle, very 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 interesting. I will teach you. That is given in your textbook. So that all. That all. I will teach you. What is that? Eight plus four, twelve. Twelve. 
So what do you want to give me? So the one here, 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 four, four, four. But here you are getting twelve. Wrong. Did you follow children? See, four plus four, eight. Eight plus four, twelve. But A value is four. But you are not getting here. You are not getting here. Three you take. Let me see. Three, three, three. So three, three, three is up nine. But you are not getting A value. So take for example five. Five plus five, ten. Ten plus five, fifteen. You are getting. Five only you are getting. Did you follow? How to do it? See here. Five. 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 Five plus five, ten. Ten plus five, fifteen. Here also five you are getting. The B value is one. B value is one. See this one is ten. This one, this one. When you add this one, the result is also a five. Then this one is correct. Therefore, A is equal to five. B is equal to one. One. This is just a puzzle. You have to think and do it. That's all. Nothing is there. Okay. Suppose some so so many sums given in your textbook. So another one now. Multiplication they have given. Multiplication they have given now. So B A. B A A. One minute, children. But this is addition now. They have given multiplication also. Multiplication also they have given. The number they have given now. B A into B A into oh uh, B three B three. So you have to find out. They have given the result fifty seven. A given. They have given. You have to find out the value A B. A B you have to find out. See here, what value you have you are giving to this A? The result should be the same. So which number you are substituting? Which number you are substituting? Three into A. Which number? What value you are giving? Here there is substituted. See five. If you take five. See three into five. Fifteen. You are getting it. Fifteen. Here one. Here one. Three into three into. What number if you give? Two you give. Two. Two you give for the B. Three twos are six. Six plus one seven. Follow it, children. Then B value is two. Once again you multiply. You are getting here fifty-seven five five hundred and seventy-five. You are getting. See here. First step. Three into five fifty. You are getting one carry. So here B value is two. So three into two, two plus one, seven. Second step you come, take it as two. Two into five, zero, zero. Second step, one carry. Two into two, four, five. You are getting. So this is the way. Therefore, A is equal to five. B is equal to two. So this is just a puzzle. So. Some more sums they have given in your textbook. You complete it. Everything. So next we will go for test of divisibility. Two, three, four, till nine table divisibility. Unit place, tens place to place. So see those places only you can predict which table divisible this number. You can easily if you know test of divisibility easy to solve the problem. So. Anyway, even algebra, arithmetic, and geometry. Test of divisibility is basic things for all the children. Okay, children. So all of you buy the textbook, go through it. I will send the notes through the WhatsApp. Thank you. Bye bye.